hey friends and welcome back to my channel in today's video we are going to fix out the issue fail to initialize critical data in gta version 5 so let's go ahead and proceed click on the start menu and type run open an application and type here services.msc and then hit the enter key here you need to find a service rockstar by pressing the r key of your keyboard here it is rockstar game library service double click to open it if the service status is stopped click on the start button to start the service at once in startup type make it automatic hit apply and okay button now go ahead and try to launch the game again if it is still giving you the error next method you need to do is to update the game as well as to verify the integrity by opening its launcher for example if you have a steam or epic games first of all you need to right choose library option right click on that particular game and click on the option update once updated next method is to click on the properties option click on local file and choose the option verify integrity of game file it will take some time so just be patient and let this integrity complete once it is completed go ahead and try to run the game again now if it is still giving you the error the next method is to again open run command and type here app data and then hit the enter key here open local folder and find a folder with the name rockstar here is rockstar game you need to right click on it and delete the folder after that restart your pc and try to play the game again however if this method also fail to work out the last option we are left with is to uninstall the better i launcher it is a launcher that prevent anti cheat and helps you to regain your integrity of the files but it is giving you the error while playing the rockstar game which is gta 5 so make sure you uninstall the better i launcher and then try to play the game again after uninstalling the better i if it's still giving you the error the last hope we have is to using rockstar game launcher i'll share this link in the description of this video open this website and click on this option which is download for windows click on this download for windows option and save it in your desktop Now once download is completed go ahead and launch the launcher and install this particular launcher in your PC simply following the on screen instructions available over here Now once it is finished close it and it will automatically launch your launcher Now go ahead and logging user using your user ID and password and play your game. So this is all about it, friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon to continue receiving more such updates from my channel. Thank you so much, friends. Thank you for watching.